you know, since you guys watch, I, I'll be like giving little tips. So here's the thing uh, with cryptocurrency. It's very volatile. We all know that. Everybody knows it. And that's what, that's what fears people away. Oh, it's too volatile. Uh, are you trying to make money or what? And how soon are you trying to make money? Because that's the, that's the waterfall of money is volatility. Any trader knows that. The sooner, the frequency, the sooner it goes up and goes down, the more motherfucking money I can get, right? So some people, it's too volatile, right? But they buy in at the highs. What the fuck kind of mentality is that? If it's too volatile, the water's rushing. The water's rushing. So what does that mean? The, the tip I give is have a disbelief threshold. Write that down. Disbelief threshold. All right, with cryptocurrency. Does not apply to any other market besides cryptocurrency. And this is, I had to learn this from experience. A disbelief threshold, okay? So check this out. What is that? What do we mean by disbelief threshold? So say there's a price of, uh, let's say the price of Bitcoin right now, okay? Right now, Bitcoin's hovering 20, $20,022, 22K, right? Realistically speaking, not realistically, in your mind, what, the, what, would, what would be the price of Bitcoin on the upside that you would just be like, no way, no, no way, no way. Everybody has their own arbitrary number in their own head, right? So if it's at 20K right now, what would be realistically in a month or two, where would you be at the point where disbelief, no way it could reach that high? Me, I'm going to be honest, just, just so I'm going to show you my, how I invest, right? So Bitcoin's at 20K, no way would it really ever hit 50k okay there you go some 50k right like 50k i would actually be like no way like no way right no i would just be like wow right so that's that would be the top okay so if bitcoin's at 20 50k at the top threshold disbelief wow right now on the bottom side on the bottom side see this is where you crypto youtubers scam you that tell you the price prediction, what it could be, what it could be. No, the, in, the reality of it, what's your disbelief threshold on the bottom side? So Bitcoin's 20K right now, where would you actually, no way Bitcoin could drop that low. No way. Some, be honest, somebody asked, no way would Bitcoin. For me, if Bitcoin's, no way would I see Bitcoin going below $15,000 anytime, like soon. Like if, if bit on the downside, if Bitcoin dropped down to 15K or like, I would just be like, wow, did not see that coming. 2K, so every, right, you can put 2K, right? Every, you do this with your investment for every single inve crypto, cryptocurrency investment. This is how the, talking about the markets of crypto. So before you invest, you're like, what, what do I see it on disbelief on the top side and on the bottom side? So for me, 15K on the bottom side, bottom threshold, right? 50K on the top side, top threshold. I am telling you for a fact, cryptocurrency will always blow your disbelief threshold on the top and on the bottom you have no that's so i'm telling you like that's the real killer right there what people don't understand whatever you disbelieve cryptocurrency will fucking skyrocket through that disbelief threshold and you'd literally sit in your seats like i did not see that coming no way did like you know same thing on the bottom market crashes so hard you're like wow i did not see that coming right so you, that's what you have to be mindful is that you can have your threshold, but cryptocurrency will, it's such a demon. It goes past it. It can go past it. And in a, in a short matter of time. So that, that's one thing to be aware is how fast it can skyrocket and how fast it can drop down. And you need to be prepared for the economic shock of how that happens, what that happens. So, that, so that's, that's when we get, how do you prepare for these economic shocks? Right? How do you prepare? How do you make set up your trades? You know where you, you can actually profit off major crashes. Right? It's called uh, what's the sentiment analysis? I won't go. I can't give up too much game, man.